tribute to one of the greatest right backs that the club and his country have ever seen. Doesn't matter the fact they were all here on Sunday, and most of them will be at Wembley on Saturday. They want to pay tribute to local boy made good, and my word, he has made good. That is for sure. His family are here, obviously, this evening, and what's a very special night, not just for Gary, but for the whole Neville family. Stacey Juventus are the hardest opponents that he's ever had, and that's the reason that they are here this evening. Promises to be a wonderful spectacle, that is for sure. And as you can see, teams are about to come out. They are in the tunnel. Great to see the likes of Paul Scholes lining up in the same side as Phil Neville. David Beckham once again, Nicky Butt, scenes that we didn't really think that we would see again, but uh, we will see them this evening. Promises to be a terrific night then, not just for Gary Neville, but for everyone associated with his family and with this club. Let's join our commentators for us, uh, Dwight York and first Martin Tyler. Well, thank you, Jeff. It is a special night, and Gary Neville will have appreciated that it follows hard on the heels of the first team getting four goals here on Sunday and the youth team scoring four last night for another FA Youth Cup success. That was the competition where it all started for the likes of David Beckham and Nicky Butt. And Gary Neville was here last night sitting where we are, Dwight, doing the commentary for MUTV, the Manchester United's own television station, putting his words to good effect as a media pundit, as he's going to be from now on. <laughs> it's good to see Ryan Giggs here at the end of what's been a difficult day for him. exceptional character dedicated every day of his working life to being successful no one quite could have put more into it yeah I think um, it's a great tribute to, to Gary Neville what he has done here at Manchester United been here for 20 years uh, you don't see those kind of commitment from a player uh, like Gary Neville and uh, what a fantastic day for, for everyone here his two daughters Molly and Sophie Guard of Honour. We talk about his character and his dedication, words that have been used a lot tonight. He is England's most capped right back, and that tells you of the skill which went along with the will. Officially, 602 Manchester United appearances. Only the fifth player to reach 600 for the club. 400 Premier League games. One-eyed about Manchester United. But as you get to know him, he's not one-dimensional at all. He's got plans for the future. Ian Brown. Stone Roses, with a microphone in hand. And he did say that Juventus were, in 96-97, the best team that he ever faced. Faced uh, Alex Del Piero there, who's captaining, of course, Juventus tonight, was part of that team. He certainly has, and uh, again, another player who's um, been at Juventus for such a long time. And, uh, you know, you don't see too many players like that anymore committed to one club. Um, but Gary Neville has done that for 20 odd years, so it's absolutely fantastic for him, and everyone is here to support the cause. Well, those who are being kept in cotton wool, you've got a glimpse of Javier Hernandez there, being kept in cotton wool for Saturday, but this Wayne Rooney does start. This is and that is a gesture from Sir Alex for Gary Neville. 
Yeah, absolutely. I mean, uh, he knows what Gary Neville meant to this club and what he's done and what he's achieved over the years, Martin. And uh, as I said, so Alex Ferguson is really appreciated and I'm sure he would be sadly missed like so many great players in the past. But uh, he would be special for this club. when you've got a little one in each arm. <laughs> I never thought I'd see the day of Gary Neville having kids, though, because he's been such a serious person in the profession. But, you know, it comes to stage in all our lives at some stage that, uh, you know, there's more to, to football. And uh, I'm pleased to see him being a father and, and that sort of stuff now. is uh, amazing. And his own father, the wonderfully named Neville Neville. <laughs> That's <laughs> absolutely Neville Neville, eh? Now I can do the honours. First, first and foremost, Sir Alex is there. And when Sir Alex calls, you have to go across. I can <laughs> assure you, the Chief Executive. Well, Gary, the presentation from the club, first of all, this beautiful work here. Well, this is a fantastic piece of art from Howard Rayleigh. Uh, Commissioned by the club for you for the uh, service you've given to Manchester United. Great service. You were one of the most loyal players in my time, and I really thank that for your service, and I think all the fans do too. Well said by the manager. And I think Phil Neville was about to say when he was cut off, what a noble career. <laughs> Gary Neville has had here. We lost a syllable or two to the crowd noise, do I think? <laughs> Absolutely. I mean, I mean he's, uh, he knows his brother really well, and uh, I'm sure he's, he'd be a proud brother there today, supporting his brother and watch what he's achieved. And uh, I think the family in general would be delighted with, uh, with the outcome of how Gary have progressed over the years. Well, I'll find a place for that in his famous new house which is to do with the campaign that he's supporting here tonight one of the campaigns the sustainable energy sustainability and sport he's an eco warrior he's been a football warrior but now he's going to try and be part of what may well be a really serious issue in the years ahead about energy efficiency and if he's turned his mind to it you can bet something's going to happen and so Bobby Charlton and Nobby Styles they went through uh, so much together as players a bit like Gary and his teammates from the class of 92 who were out there on the pitch I bet Bobby and Nobby would love to be playing tonight and give them half a chance they would I'm sure, given half the chance, Martin, that we all would. <laughs> Including Dennis Law. Fantastic footballer as well. Huh? When you are, the players. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you must have had a chance of getting the shirt tonight, right? Well, I've got to be honest, I thought I really did have a chance. I was hoping to get the call, uh, and I thought I was going to get the call, but unfortunately, I didn't get it. <laughs> Well, let's confirm the lineups for you, and it is a roll back the years selection for this Manchester United team tonight. Believe it or not, it's nine and a half years since the two Nevilles, David Beckham, Nicky Butt, Paul Scholes, and Ryan Giggs, all started in the Premier League together. Wes Brown and John O'Shea of similar vintage, United allowing Wayne Rooney to start, as we've said, and Michael Owen gets a game after wrapping up the Premier League season with that fourth goal here on Sunday. Seven can be used from that long list of substitutes. The Juventus have brought all the fit members of their first-team squad, captained by Alex Del Piero, who has scored in two games here in the Champions League. Fellow members of the World Cup-winning squad, 
for Italy in 2006 in Luca Toni and Andrea Bazzagli. Milos Krasic, the Serbian winger, is another with an Old Trafford goal to his name for CSKA Moscow.